Ooh, here we go. I wonder who was it? It seems like we are streaming, but it does not look like anyone is saying anything or can see us now. Hello? Okay. Ring, ring, hello. Oh, hello. Uh -huh. ring, hello. Oh. Jonathan, hello. Oh, my goodness. Like that. I've been in the car park in a really long time. Ooh. We are Nya. We are okay. here. Um, where's the little book? I had it written down. Uh, hello. Oh, hello. 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 So many wonderful people. I did not know that Remy was your sister, Jonathan. I didn't know that either. Wow. <laughs> I didn't know that like you were relating it, man. Oh, your sister. Hi, sister. But you, you didn't get that, Maya? Oh, hi, Tevis. Hello. Uh... But yeah, uh, oh, yes, uh, uh, hi Danielle, hi Magpie, and Remy, I think you're Tamara. Oh, E EK wants to be. Wants to be Tia or Tamara? I can't tell, but I I like the whole thing about it. Do you get? I, the... I don't know the differences between Tia and Tamara. I really don't either, because the idea was that they were too similar to like tell the difference between because they could mm. like change. They 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 they, they easily change like their disguises well. Mm -hmm. Their disguises. They disguises. You are too young. So, Magpie, there was a show on what used to be called the Disney Channel back when there was something called cable television. Um, and uh, it was great. It was about uh, Tia and Tamara Mowry being twins. And, um, yeah, and the shenanigans therein. It felt very Zack and Cody-ish, but it was um, before that. Jonathan, I said it in the future, and you heard it in the past. You I, probably I will said it. Do everything before you. There is no escaping this. <laughs> you did probably say it at the same time, probably because probably. we are on a delay. Oh, was it on the ABC and the, oh the, the the WB? That was just past my time. I, I remember that it was a thing. And that it had Top Model and Buffy on it for a little bit. Hmm. Okay, so yeah, uh, Jonathan and Ek. Uh, I don't know what your name is, sister. That, was, that sounded weird. Yes. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> tell us how you would like to be addressed. Um, yeah. Yes, and I'm assuming she, her pronouns, if that is okay. Sister will do wonderful. Excellent. Yes, and tomorrow yeah. is my birthday. Yeah, no chat just any to you too. Yay, I'm excited. Although I realized that I think I did it wrong because Usually, okay, so one thing is that we uh, oh, we, we decided that for, for ease of creating a kind of wishes of, of well-being on holidays in time for Sukkot uh, mid-autumn festival deadline, we basically just uh, decided to not mark person for imperatives. As, as one can do. Um, but I have marked it for second person in happy birthday to show that 
you are the one who is celebrating festively the birthday, which may or may not be right, but it's our language, so there you go. I guess it doesn't matter. Speaking of the devil, I believe that. Um, let's see. I'm hoping that it's gonna. Sh Yay! It's shown up. I'm in the document. Who's that wonderful girl? It's a document. Could she be any cuter? Okay, so we um have well, Jake had put some ideas um of kind of the directions under which um we were planning on a doing um kind of just thinking especially um nominalization strategies um were discussed betwixt the both of us um so maybe trying to employ especially in Kongwa, something a little different um something a little um built upon or counterparting like our product and our agent um derivation so our two main strategies for nominalization both will both come from verbs obviously but only obviously but one comes from it is the product of the um verb so like there was like most of the result of doing it but like what comes from it and then the other is um an agent which performs said verb and that's about it and um potentially more um diverse ways of doing it especially with um some classifiers uh potentially yeah so um well we can nominalize with classifiers in in Yat um, cool. so mm, I think the thing that would be confusing would be if we normalize with classifiers, but we also essentially do object marking with classifiers, then we we may end up with two constructions that look the same. Mm, mm. Um, um, okay. I did want to say, uh, well, Jonathan and sister are here. Um, yes. I I had suggested we might translate happy birthday in Yatlao for them. I think that is um, the first thing that we should do for sure. Um, okay. I also want to point out that um, Jonathan told sister to guess where I'm from. And so far she has guessed Canada. Um, no province included, so I will guess just Ontario and Louisiana. And um, sister, um, I will say that um, you are on the correct continent. Um, so good on that. Um, but I will I, I will reveal the location. I will let you delve into the forays that is the speech patterns of my English language. Um, and we'll go from there. You have like an hour and a half. Have fun. Um, but let us therefore. Um, the birthday we... gift is a dialect puzzle. From, yeah, from I guess so. You. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to pause on over to the um, blurbles. Um, what's it called? Let us yeah, know when yeah. you go in and we'll. we'll um... We'll, we'll, we'll dock smiles publicly then. Yay! And Yay. I believe that nicely had changed to the Yatlao document. Um, ooh, pancakes. Ooh. Ooh. Wonderful. Uh, so I think the one, the two main, well, the three main things that we need to figure out on is, um, do we have a word for day? Um, do we have, we have a, a word for birthday even? 
oh, we're two thirds of the way done. Now we gotta just say um something about happy happiness. Uh wait, wait. Did I did I do it right? Yeah, I did. And uh well what we what we already have in some mm -hmm. section that I can't remember where we put it now, which is the the height of professionalism that, oh, that we cool. have come to offer you in these last four weeks. You're welcome. Um, uh, is it in culture? No. Um. Hmm. <laughs> remember, it might be in like the the. Are you in like the the Elhab doc, or are you like in like the? Yeah, I'm in the club. Oh, the club. Club. Completing a year. Oh, that's where I don't know. That's where it comes from. I thought it was like, like literally, like um, what's it called? Um, complete. Oh, I don't know what's completing the year, but I believe well, sun. That first part um is the word for sun, and um isha, um is the word to be born. So essentially, mm -hmm. it's like the sun on which you were born. Um, and then you smush that um, that first step on you get sign she out of that. Oh, it's because we you took the culture out of our language. <gasps> and the social linguists everywhere. Wow, I'm so sorry, Remy. I did not mean um, to remove the cultural traditions of our con culture that you could analyze for your sociolinguistic ventures. I uh, will pop them in here, and then we just have to remember that they've been doubled up later. Uh, there. So, for everyone who is wanting to say things to us, uh, this is how far we got. <laughs> oh. uh, so, Schlonza is uh, good morning. Uh, Kalfa is uh, afternoon. Uh, uh, Shiba is sh sorry. Shiba is a uh, happy new moon. Uh, uh thanks. Oh, oh wait. Uh, we've said we we have a cultural uh, we have a cultural uh, a logical inconsistency going on because uh, I've also put in the Discord how to say, may the spirits avoid you. Mm -hmm. um, although, to be fair, we have left out the word uh, for the spirits. So it could be that we are saying the good spirits. True. I mean, I wouldn't say that's assumed. I, like, it, I mean, especially if it's a message of gratitude, that, that death, though, would probably be the good spirits. Yeah. Oh, um, Schlidu. Schlidu, Schlidu, Schlidu. Uh, and this is why we we love the fact that we don't have a uh, Yatlao to English uh, section. And also, Schlidu doesn't appear in this version. Uh, I love being a Konlanger. We are so great at it. We, re we really are. We, we, we know how to organize a document extremely well. It's a skill that we have grown up learning. And um, perfecting, I would say. Found it. Uh, OK, River Spirit is There is one thing that I have learned to love, and it is the headings of Google Docs. Wait, I think I must have just put it in badly. Oh, it's. It's Schlidu, not Slidu. Yeah, Schlidu. Have I is it wrong in the phrase list? I don't believe so. Right? No. Yeah. I just um as as another thing the Discord has proven, I can't spell. I mean, you know, when when you're spelling, you know, oh I just doxed you, whoopsie. But that's okay. Everyone knows your email now. Woo, have fun. Um, wow. Wow. I'm so sorry. Um, Someday my Nigerian prince will find me. Oh, so I hope I hope well for you. 
Okay, Joe now song. I can't really add the use and then do your accent where all of those diphthongs get smoothed out. John 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 song. John song. Why am I doing an S for T H? It's like I I've embodied the Spanish spirit. <laughs> anyway. Anywho, okay. So we got a word for birthday. Yeah. And we need to, to spread some happiness. So I guess, like, may the good spirits not catch you, but catch your birthday. Like, may... So, well, I mean, do, do we want to, like... Hmm... So ideas include letting the spirits, yeah, uh-huh. So we wish you birthday. Now, one thing that I found in my birthday congratulation making journey mm. yesterday mm -hmm. was um, the, I was looking at the Vietnamese version and it is literally just wish birthday. Love it. Um, but I don't think it makes sense here because um, uh, when when you use that construction, I think that it's only used in the positive. Yeah. Which we could say uh, works in this situation. Um, uh, so... Um, because it was using the optative, the chi, chi, yep. um, but also, um, I, I, we don't have a word for happy, we have a word for content, which honestly, I do love. Like, I'm fine with like contentment being like the like the general semantic range of happiness because like isn't like like our word for tasty is like content of or well it's 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 to be content or to be satisfied so mm -hmm. I, I i think that semantically is the range of happiness the real question is okay is sister happy being content on birthday is sister content with or satisfied with birth we wish you a birthday sister is, is this is this sufficient yes we 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 need sister approval and now we have to wait like 30 seconds for the sister approval proposal yeah. to to be passed down the pipelines across the atlantic Slash. I don't well, know what's in between where you are and where sister I, is. I might not even be between. You know, I like s sister and you might even be flanking me. I may be in between you, like, both of you. And oh, approved. We have the approval stamped. Okay, Vietnamese wins once again. Sorry, America. Um, translation. Oh, do we want to add a clue? <laughs> I'm sorry. I, I, I was just um, laughing at your Vietnam War joke. Go ahead. I mean, Vietnam War jokes are really the staple of the Conlangian community, are they not? Yeah, I, I, I would say so. Um, I, I openly joke about Ronald Reagan and capitalism with my students today. So you know what? No. It's a good time. I mean, as was the Vietnam War for everyone involved. I don't know why you think that's funny, Miles. I don't know why I do either. I think it's just because it's so ingrained in American culture, especially like with the onset of like American exceptionalism, like the oh, I found Vietnam. You know, like it's 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 like that mentality that I find like. Oh wait, we said content birthday. Con con a content oh, birthday. So we need to we need to add Sue. 
but we also if we're okay we have this argument about we we can we can use the viewers to settle this Currently, oh. our grammar went. Our grammar went from being kind of like Thai, where, uh, and I'll write this out so people can see it, where you have a, a noun, uh, and then a. Why, why are you doing that, Google Docs? And then you have your uh, classifier. And then you have your noun. And in here, in Thai, you can have two things. You can have a demonstrative. Uh, I didn't want that to be in capitals as well. Or you can have a numeral. So when you're counting things or when you're using demonstratives, you have this requirement of a classifier. Now. And we're pretty in, in agreement with this now. This, this was never up for debate. This was no. the baseline. Yeah. And you can't convince us otherwise that this is not an excellent idea mm -hmm. because Thai is an excellent language. I heard it has a really hard writing system, though. Yeah, although I've also heard that the person who made the video that convinced a lot of people that Thai was a really hard writing system was just being a bit annoying about it. Um, in the nicest way possible. And you know, that, that, that is a foray that can be went and gone with and whatsoever, but also I have been using the word foray for a long while now, and it, it has been a part of my vo vocabulary repertoire. Anyway, um, the main area of contentment, as with most, um, like um, documents um, that had been written long ago, is we had said that we can use, say, modifiers. Oh, you're way ahead of me. And yeah, so that a noun with a modifier must be obligatorily used with a classifier. So this vaguer ish term yeah has been please zoom in bet ah uh, sorry wait oh no it's your it's your fault miles oh i know as always yep and so if i'm gonna make tie you then know. nice So modifier will vague honestly, will that mean like adjective, which I kind of have been going down that? Um will that include say um numeric modifiers such as like many, some, every uh, quantifier. Quantifiers, thank you. Um I'm trying to think of anything else. Will that include both? Um, or, or even so, both. both. It could be both, couldn't it? It could be both. It, it's fine. It was making a joke at the expense of, of David J. Peterson. Oh, both. 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 But both. it probably doesn't sound quite right with my accent. Both and Foe. Yeah. Foe. Both. That 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 word is unequivocally folk. That L is that L is for sure pronounced. And I will um yes. Anywho, we need to get a poll done going. So I'm going to press this little plus bar that says engage with your audience. I'm gonna click start a poll. And I'm going to ask a question is what does this document in her past selves refer to as modifiers? Adjectives. 
quantifiers. Spell correctly. Oh yeah, I want to add that option. Oh yeah. Or bold. Well, you know what? I'm gonna do this. Bold. Let's not be that extra me. But let's just kind of be you take. Bold. I'm glad someone here appreciates my humor when it isn't about the Vietnam War. I think I was caught off guard. I, 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 I mean, the thing is, like, such a making fun of Americans is such a deep part of British pastime, and rightfully but, so. We we deserve it. No, but British people, like, I mean, we deserve it too, and we recognize that by also making fun of ourselves, right? So I don't know if you will appreciate this, but one of my coworkers is British. Like he is from Manchester and mm -hmm. um, he is, I think from fucking Salford or something, but digress. Salford. 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 Anyway, he, he brought in beans on toast for like the homeroom experience. Uh, uh huh. Oh, it was in heaven. There was brown sauce, which I excluded, but I would have adored some like cheese, like on top. Uh huh. That would that would have been a tasty boots. But regardless, beans on toast is um, an important breakfast food mm -hmm. that I find you know bang up. Mm -hmm. I'm curious how you pronounce bran. Like brain, like the cereal brain, brain, and brain, 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 and bran. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Wait. I think I think the viewers at home probably are also enjoying this this insight into this lesser known dialect of English. So rhymed with crayon is bran. Yeah, I agree with that. You're killing me. But like you, you, you said three words. You said bran, and then brain, and then something in the middle. Brown. Brown, like b r b r o w n. Yes, brown. Brown. And um, do you, is it also bra for eyebrow? Brow. Eyebrow. I, eyebrow, uh, eyebrow. Okay, you you do say the the word more we what 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 sounds like a a Yatla word. Sweet. What? -y. Oh, we'll we'll put it down. Let let's make it a word for something. Heck, bruh. What's up, bruh? Eyebrow. Ah. Okay. Uh, anyway, I think I wanted to close it off in. Five. Your votes in four, three, two, one. You're done. So the um winner is Bolt. Bolt win. Okay, it doesn't exist already. Oh, the con doesn't work because of the delay. Wealth. You know, it does not exist already. What e? What e? What e? Eyebrow could eyebrow more like eyebrow could eyebrow because tie. Thai. Mm. Welcome to the the third best conlanging stream. <laughs> that I'm actually no, there there are more famous people who do this as well. <laughs> yes, who, who whom star we to Oops. grace the presence? Well, I mean, I didn't say who was first or second, so you all can fill that in. Who's on first? I mean, who knows? But what's on second? I I rever reserve the right to uh, to not say anything. Oh, you uh, stopped short. I I am not going to dig this hole any deeper than I have to. Mm. Not that I think that people are actually 
going to watch this and think, uh, oh, 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 I think I remember this. Uh, the attendance of sister at, uh, I mean, DJP I, standing I, for I, Dr. Jesse Peterson, obviously. Oh, well, of, of course. Or, or just pronounced Dijd. Dijb. Yeah. Long time? Long, 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 long time. Anywho, <laughs> we need to get our butts going because we are half hour in and we are nowhere close. Well, we are halfway close. But essentially, is that according to the people at home, a classifier <laughs> shall go near. Okay, so I had this question yesterday, and I'm sorry if what I gave you is wrong, Jonathan. It might be wrong in multiple ways now. Woo! Do you yeah. think that a... So we have two clown... Clown? Two uh, time-based classifiers. Clown, clown classifiers would be uh, interesting uh, anyway. <laughs> I don't know where that, that would that would be that would be beholden on many other things. So, uh, if you if you uh, zoom to me, um, thank you, Jonathan. Just so you know, um, two clowns. That's what we're watching right now. And you know, what what is laugh other than us performing for a circus? That's what Britney Spears tried to tell us, but we just didn't listen. So. Can 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 you see me? Yeah. No. Zoom. Click on my little face. Click on your little face. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Can I pin you? Oh, I can. I can't. I can't. Does this do anything for those at home? Let's see. Okay. I I pinned you. I don't know. No. I, I mean. I mean in the dog. Oh, zoom. Oh, zoom to you. Oh, yeah. I'm so stupid. Thank you. That makes more sense. Anywho. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? You know, we're, we're, we're here. It was my last day of, like, work, so I'm just, like, vibing. I want to unpin you. Okay, so. What if they want to see my face? No, 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 no. Anyway. <laughs> I want to be perceived. <laughs> so we have these two classifiers at the moment. So we have this word, uh, which is times and durations. And we've also said uh, days in the Kongwa doc. And then we have pu, which is short from uh, uh, kupu, um, which is nights and performances. Um, is a birthday, are we? counting it as a day or a night because i have gone with day in congo and i think it makes more sense i think that makes more sense as well okay um i i think even it it crosses into that like durations kind of thing wait um did did we because the other thing we have is um if we go to sun, mm -hmm. then I, I'm so confused. I'm sure that I sorted a whole bunch of stuff out. And I maybe I just didn't follow through with everything. Um, yeah. I'm sure if we go to sun, what happened to Ngai? Is it is that under day? Oh, okay. So, um, what has happened here? Okay, we have another instance in which the universe has not been aligned across documents. Oh, okay. I. On the one hand, it's a bit unfortunate because uh, it means that. Sometimes things are going missing um, when we are, um, are moving things across. 
on the other hand, uh, it means that um, basically you don't have to deal with the fact that our other document has about three years worth of bullshit going on in it. Yeah, pretty much. And trying to sort through that is like we we need to like get like an unpaid intern to do that. Yeah. Um, so we know the classifier for day. And it's Hooray. No. No. So I think I think it still works though. We use the word sun for day in compounds in Yatlao. Um, I think it does make sense. And the sun of your birth does does work. Um, so, Tulu Sai Shishu Nai. Tulu Sai Shishu Nai. Tulu Sai Shishu Nai. And anyway, you've mm -hmm. heard us try and speak this language more than enough. And yes. It is near and dear to our hearts, but you know. Oh yes, we can we can invoke the older sister. So um this is actually one of the cooler things that we did. Um we did this as a response to um a a online question of the week, which was asking about kinship terms. And I thought, you know what everyone loves about Chinese is the fact that they have older and younger siblings, because that way you can indicate the better sibling of the two kinds. Um, and in this way, um, we, I, I was looking at Mandarin, and basically their words for older sibling, I think, have got some, one of them was borrowed from Manchu or Mongolian, I think. And I thought, oh, so one way you can get this is by basically borrowing a term from another language that has a different kind of nuance. Um, and so I took this idea that um, the Yatlao people when they are in conflicts, they would take secondary uh, partners as kind of uh, battle uh, rewards. Um, and it would mean that a, a younger sibling was more likely to be a speaker of one of the other languages. Um, and so the terms for younger sibling come from uh, the Plains language family and the words for older sibling are the native words. Noise. So, Lutza and clue for the vocative. Yeah, get that clue in there. Is it clue or clue? It's clue. Clue. Yeah, clue, clue. is a. Uh, is it flood? Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I have reason not to believe you. Nice. Yeah, I mean, the questions of the week were were a lot of fun. They were and a lot of fun. I do suspect that Jessie is just in the height of her busyness right now. I also would probably surmise that. I deserve a snack. Well, I'm, I'm going to get a snack, but... I wanted, to, I wanted to kind of do two things. A, Jonathan had said that Sister um, had named more states. Um, so far, they have not indicated whether Sister is correct. But my, my assumption is no. Um, the second um, is that my snack today is um, matcha Kit Kats that I found at World Market. Um, they are very tasty. Um, they're not my favorite of the Japanese Kit Kats. I do like there's the two levels of matcha. Um, this is the like the latter version of it. And I mean, like, yes, it is okay. Uh, but like I, I, I like I like the, the richer. I need the like the more deep matcha. 
I'm curious what your favorite Japanese Kit Kat flavor is. Mine is the melon one from Hokkaido. Ooh, see, I don't like melon, so that definitely ain't gonna be mine. Like mine is like either the um like the um the the, the deeper matcha or like I think there's like a brownie sugary one. Oh yeah, yeah. There's yeah. there's one that you can like put the in bubble. the in a I guess like the kind of like in America the toasters are like um the the heat goes from top to bottom right mm. versus like the kind of toasters we have oh yeah Xianbei. um yeah so that's the language that the so the people that we think of as the huns and the huns in mulan we mm. went from thinking they were the same to thinking they were wait 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 Xianbei is different from xiongnu isn't it I think I got that wrong. Anyway. But um, yeah. Yeah. So, like, British toasters, you put the meat, meat? You put the, the bread ah. in the top. And so you can't use them to toast your creme brulee. Um, wait, are you thinking of the creme brulee ones? Or, I or is think... that actually a brown sugar flavor? I don't, I don't remember, but it's good. Also, yeah. I'm realizing that we, we are doing a complete Langtime Studios move and not getting anything we can mm -hmm. use done. Correct. <laughs> For the first 45 minutes of stream. Mm -hmm. Anywho, I'm scrolling down. To where yes. we have our one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight words. We know what we're doing for the 31st, but okay. we need eight more words. First thing. Um, okay, people generally don't enjoy making forms, but can they can they pick a route for uh wai? Ooh, yeah, what would wai mean? Wai. Yeah, so we're, we're looking for something that is kind of like the, the thing that I guess most of our viewers will be familiar with will be the Pacific Northwest. Mm -hmm. um, otherwise, you can think of like native Irish stuff. But I mean, as an English person, um, I can't really acknowledge their culture. It's just a a thing that that we are trained to avoid uh, unless we're like giving out book prizes <gasps> oh my god newt 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 yeah i we're, we're we're going we're going oh dear god we're going to figure out one of the i mean we got a second for newt we got third i'm, I'm assuming sister is third for we got fourth for newt yeah it's uh, it's you want to make a poll um for for which is it new with with no exclamation marks new with two oh. exclamation marks or new with three exclamation marks because i think it's quite important that we decide that i completely concur i concur completely completely i concur completely concur i Also, I'm just going to check that I got the form right. Wait, what? What? I have been betrayed. Something something has refreshed my browser, and it got rid of the Lexigy files I had put in. Oh, if it's W-A-H-I, it came out as Y-E, which I think is the correct form. Yeah. Wonderful. Uh, and I'm just checking, and it'll be Wahi in uh, Kongwa. Oh. So. Oh, mine closed out as well. Ooh, ooh. You have the Kongwa document because I'm on my work computer because my one did not do anything good. No, we do have a word for newt. Sorry. Sorry. I don't know why I'm shouting. Do you have a word for salamander? On the other side of the Atlantic Ocean. 
Uh, so what we do in this situation is um, ooh, we ooh, find I had a good idea. Okay, mm -hmm. I want to look because there'll be oh, okay. I wanted just to check. I want to see what is up. Actually, oh god, I think yeah, newt is good, but it could also be just the verb to be new. What does to be new mean? To be neutral? No, to be new, N E W. Oh, new. New. I feel like I feel like that's not what the people have, have voted for. Oh, the, yeah, I mean the people have not voted for this. Um you know, so I, I'm gonna end this poll now because you know Okay. Th 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 uh, this poll is is moot. Um, do you, do we have biologists in in the chat? So Tethys is shouting a word that says "eft." Eft, um, I think, is the old English word. Oh. Um, yeah. If the oh. oh, oh, eft is Middle English. There, there's oh, who is an eft? Yes, an an eft. And then is is I'm assuming Jonathan, you're you're saying that is what the, what, 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 sorry. Um so in old English there's uh what I'm guessing is Arthur Arthur sir. I don't know how to pronounce that. Lizard badger. Oh god. Avixer. Avixer. So F are young newts. Newtling. So is like a f like a newt larva? Oh, okay. A newt fetus. Oh, f also exists in modern English, but it's specifically a a land dwelling stage. Oh, so oh, a, it's newlets. Yeah, a newt. Oh, well, I think that's just a little keen. I think that I like that. New newts, new, new newts. Yeah, I th I, th I think I think it is the definition shall be f comma newtlet comma newt new. So, are we putting them in as f? Well, I guess we have the word red in our lexicon. Um, I will make this a one and a two. Yes, I I oh no, no. One here comes the two to the three to the four. Because the preceding word for newt is tall, uh, tall, 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 Oh my god, but Wai is so cute for the word for a baby in New York. Wai. 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 Wai ya chao. No, that's terrible. Chao. Wai ya chao. Wai ya chao. 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 Yeah. We need cha to mean something. Um, Chum. well, let's look at our list of words that we want words for and assign it to something we think is rooty enough to deserve it. Yes, or a or like key. We can't get key, we can get like key or cool. I honestly think, and this is this is me speaking into the future. I'm I'm not prophesying. I'm manifesting the difference. But like, I think that one of the sound changes that might could happen in Yao go. I keep saying Yao Yao Tao going like forward is that al allophonically, um, first I I think in general. 
that the Val U um, falling palatals um, is going to front. And I think what might could happen is that um, it's probably going to become phonemic in like a loss of a palatals um, in front of, say, I mean, it could be even a clear cut loss of palatals eventually. But I don't want to manifest nothing, but I think we could get a nice contrasting between U and U phonemically and like easily. We have we have U allophonically already, don't we? We have U allophonically. We don't have U phonemically. That's what, yeah. that's what I'm thinking about. But regardless, um, al allophonically, on um, Matei's, where are you? And I'm so sorry if you are sleeping because it's your up time. If if Matei's is in bed at twenty past ten, no, twenty past eleven. Yeah, on, on I, a Wednesday night. Yeah. All right. Oh, what's going on? No, Mateus has been alerted. Oh, good. Mute. Um, yeah. Are we doing both? Are we doing both? Oh, oh, new look. Yep. Or a new clip. Oh, a new clip. I'm just trying to find a convenient oral high tone E. Is that all? Oh, I found one. Right. What right. kind of keyboard do you got? I have General American. So you just gone all robotic on my end. I don't know if that's the case for any other people at home. Um, uh, you also just went robotic -y. Oh, wonderful. And now we're back. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Wait, so, wait, what was the word that you wanted to exist? Tom? Oh, John. Yeah. So, like, it was going to be... C H A E protoform. Bang up. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Have a get long. Hmm. Um. I don't think we can get long high tone. Ah. Oh. I think I think you're right. It would become a uh, Yeah. No. Wait, can we with uh with a uh, oh one, I did it wrong. Yeah. Oh no, that's yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, no. that's yeah, but um if we do, do yeah cha um so ta ta. Oh yeah, yeah. It's uh, it's Ooh. merged, hasn't it? Yes. Jonathan and I'm assuming sister are going. Um, goodbye. I, I, we, we would say we'll have another booba later, but this, this might, this, this will probably be the last booba for a while. So we will booba eventually again in the future. Yeah. Okay. Yes. The boobas will be back. The boobas will be back. Thank you. And and Jonathan, you may totally reveal I mean you 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 know. You may reveal to sister my location and my life story. Mm -hmm. Thank you, sister. Um birthday as well. Uh let's say it. Let's say it. Let's say it. Let's say it. Okay. I got to read it because I, Lord knows that I'm going to. Yes. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Go us.
Go us. Okay. Bye. Bye. Okay, I will drop. Bye. We're, we're not. We're okay. Oh, oh, only Jonathan and Hester are leaving. We're not going. Just to clarify, people, we're we're still here. Yeah. I want to make sure that's good. But yes, okay, we are golden sawsome sawsoms. Okay. So, um, one word down. How many more to go? <laughs> oh yeah, we have seven more to go. Okay. Now, well, luckily, we are at least getting to a place where we like because we have the proto forum of what something is going to mean, which I completely butchered up. Heck yeah! We need this, and now we're just making Japanese pronoun memes in our language, so that's lovely. And I'm going to do this because i think that's oh, not what i wanted pronoun memes oh 10. yes there you go oh oh we're doing ta ta not ta 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 no, no. Anyway, well, you might even already have this TBH. Okay, yeah, right. But it is time for the real stream to go. Yeah, we don't have thing that I dislike about Jonathan. Yes, <laughs> this, is our, this is our. This is now our diatribe. Well, we have ta. We have. We could have na. Do we have sama yet? Sama? Yeah. We do not. Oh, you got it. Okay. You got it. You totally got this. Because I'm going to make... Cause, cause this can be used for ja, cha, cha, natha. For Jonathan. That would come as like... Na, <laughs> Which other ones are there? Um, uh, Watashi. Or, oh, oh, Kore. You mean that one? Like, Kore. Oh, I mean, not... uh, Kaole. Kao, Kao, Kao Lai? I think it would have to be. Like, uh, to get it to get that would become in uh, Kongwa, uh, yeah, that Kore. definitely would. I think, I think we saved those last three because he, these are four roots. These, this is reserved for some, some derivational thingy thing. Either that or one of these shall become a new derivation pattern. This one excluded because this is too close to cool. Mm. I mean, what we could do is if if people suggest some ideas, we could always open up a wonderful uh, world lexicon of grammaticalization. Sure. The, yeah. Uh, mm. I feel like I'm a beauty makeup YouTuber. <laughs> like, mm. uh, that's 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 the second edition. Yeah, Aria, you're totally the one that David, David hasn't read from cover to cover. Ooh, whoa, yeah, that 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 cover is not focusing. Focus on me. Okay. So. So. Um, if if you want to suggest some ideas, we can then go to our source target list, the section that we usually never use, and try and find something that we can uh, grammaticalize from them. So ideally, we're looking 
for some more um no, like nominalization strategies or do we want to maybe think about i think we can just go with whatever if we need to nominalize in yatlao uh, in a Kongwa, we can we can fix that when we get there we can fix it when we get there um, um we don't have an augmentative but i'm fine with having an augmentative one thing i am thinking is that kaolai um we I, we need to check whether pro, i'm guessing cow and Lai might exist independently so we may okay. end up with like i don't know i guess it would have to be like ka and ulai um but making this yeah. a compound what i will say though is that we we had mentioned that we are running very steadily out of monosyllables and we want to bolster up longer forms which i think i don't disagree with that but i do i don't mind the compound idea because we do have we, we wait do we have Cow we don't have we don't have um ka or kai but let me check uh lie uh because because no both of those oh that kind of thing all of them are yeah. free okay. so we could go either with um where where are we so we could either go with ka plus gulai or mm -hmm. uh, ka plus gulai. Um, yeah. I think that's fair. Yeah. Actually, truth truth might be an interesting compound to to make from this. It really could be. It's going to be a definitely a foray or definitely a, a difficult thing to um, make out of like maybe two existing new words. But I think yeah, I I, I say that's not a bad idea. I mean, we can always just fudge it if the words we want already exist. Let's be honest. Fair, fair. We can. There's, there, there, there's plus mean synonyms in the world. Yeah. Um. Hmm. How how will we get truth? Um. Truth could actually be a nominalization. Mm -hmm. Um, although actually having lie be the source of a nominalizer would make it very similar to the plural. Yes. However, with the plural, it is not only natal nasalizing but assimilating to that vowel. So it's oh, only go. Oh, oh. I have. I have an idea. Oh, what oh, oh. We should even make Kaula plus E. Okay. I was going to suggest that idea, and I thought it was like like too chaotic, but also, like, I think it's so smart. I love that. Uh, because we do not, I don't think we have just. I don't e. think we do. We can't control F it because God knows that we're going to get like. Although, actually, actually, oh, no. we, I think that we we might want to make it something weak that then reduces to just either. Like I was going to think like. Or we say this is really old. I think we just maybe we just say this is really old. Uh, yes. Um. Because, like, Korean has a whole huge numbers of um, particles that are just E and, and seem to have been since the beginning of the Korean language, as far as I think people can tell. Because, I mean, 
with a word like E, it's going to get degraded. Like, like you're like it's so weak that I, I it's like it's going to like mean evil will come and go and move and move and move just through it, you know? Okay, so Mateus, Mateus is pretending that he has a life outside of Huang Lang Yang. Uh, with an official I, work email. Mateus, please never change. I. <laughs> Um, <laughs> um, um, you should have found a way to make it an official work letter so you could have written an owl um, oh yeah that's um, but I, I guess that would end up being a, an electronic letter and that sounds far too much like the French Enforced word for email. It got lost in the email. Uh, Anywho, so. Kaula cannot mean to be true. I think well, that's. Are we going to go the very common route and say it means like to be straight? Or are we too queer for that? Because I, I think, think we I are. Think you are. Um, sorry for um, all those heterophobes out there. Um, the next thing I'm thinking of in terms of queer references for correctness is or uh, for truth is the term correct, as in that feels correct or it feels correct, as used on many, many drag races now. I'm associating it at the moment with the currently airing. Drag Race Canada. I don't know why I'm doing a promotion for them, but anyway, uh, go watch that. It's fun. Melinda Vergas Drag Race. Um, I I am behind on um, Canada's Drag Race. Um, I, I'm behind on a lot of Drag Race. To be fair, it's fine. And I, I mean, they, they they crank them out like Michelle Duggar did babies. So I mean, it's like, are we? One thing I'm thinking is, are we gonna make this like E? Uh, can I steal this from somewhere? Yeah. Um, we because we already have this word, and it means we already have that, word. but. This would mean that uh, if we have a double vowel sequence, then the epithetic uh, urgency say that. What did I say? Epim I, epithetic. I think I see. I I feel the th is coming, and I panic. Epim epithetic. Epithetic. Epim yeah. Anyway. Oh. Oh, oh, ah. oh, just, I just understood what you said. Absolutely. That makes a lot of sense. So, like, that, like, that, that, like, yeah, is added, like, if there's a vowel, vowel sequence at the end. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, 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 yes. I like this. Okay. I do. Alphonically. Was there anything else about owls? Um, maybe. But I don't know. You can't say. I. It combines I, owls and greatness. Yeah. Is that, that, I, that, that your passions? I mean, emphasis on the word passion. I mean, oh, oh, wow. Um, anywho, we are we are three words out, and we are twenty minutes from the end of the stream i i mean we i we have a good framework in thinking where we're going the only thing we got to do is basically ascribe some meanings to all these forms that we have um i mean i know we have a causative um derivation um but what we could do Mm. Is um is have 
a a word that means like for for the for the double entendre, basically to erect or to make stand. Mm. Um, and so, if something is is standing, then it is uh, it is true. If that makes sense. Yes, it is. It is um, built into that position as the way, as like the truth. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm see. I see where you're going with this. I'm trying to think of a counterpoint, um, just to, just to bring some ideas in. But I think that's the leading theory that um, to 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 become erect, to make stand, to oh, um, um, to, to to just to erect. Yeah, I mean, Jet, let's do it. I, I mean, why hasn't YouTube taken this off? Because <laughs> it's gonna it's gonna come out as eat, and that's the sound that I make. Hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Hello. I mean, we're we're fully just embracing the Great British Bake Off as it all. And using oh. words that we shouldn't be using. And then Arias pointed out that that came up at 69 minutes. So, you know. That is, can we say it on one, two, three, and we'll say it together? We'll say nice. Nice. Okay, nice. Okay, ready? Nice. One. Nice. 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 Well, if something is nice, well, he, 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 here here's what I'm going to say. If something is nice, right, does that mean that it is different and unusual? Or are those three distinct qualities? Nice, different, and unusual. unusual. Yeah, it's not nice, it's different than usual. I mean, I do think, like, a word for unusual could then take on this idea of exotic, which could then be considered nice, oh. which is an interesting way of getting there, which could also become a word for good. It could also become a word for um, rich or like wealthy. If something is exotic, it, it has like rarity to it. And now I'm thinking about, oh, she's different. I'm thinking about that one Star Trek episode where he tried to collect data and, like, he was, he almost became trapped on the ship because he was wanting just to, to collect all of these, like, ones off in the, like, universe. Because data is the only android ever made. I don't know what you're referring to, but I support you. Oh, I'm referring to the one only Star Trek, the new generation, or the next generation. I haven't seen any of it. And you know, th that that's okay. That's all right. That's okay. Uh, oh. uh, <laughs> why are you trying to explain this to your friends? Are you trying to keep your friends? Or are you trying to push them away? Yeah. How how many bridges do you want to keep? Assu assuming you want to keep the bridges. Ah, well, yeah. Well, because lore, lore was made, and then lore went on that one planet and, like, made, like, I, like lore made clones, right? Or, like, command an army. I know, like, he controlled the crystal entity. But also, like, oh, you have not seen TNG. Okay, wonderful. Love that. Everybody should watch TNG um, on Paramount Plus now. You can also watch RuPaul's Drag Race on there. Um, I, um, shout out to um, Jesse Peterson. Uh, I've been watching Murder, She Wrote. Um, and that has been my... Um, new obsession. Thank you, Remy, also for that. Um, one of these could be horned out. I love it. Um, 
I, I, I think, um, Oh, Jake is making a comment here. Um, trans New Guinea rights. And I, yeah. I agree. Um, the, the, the rights of New Guinea trans people need to be respected. I mean, but also free, free West Papua. Oh, I will. Yes. And because. Yes. And because who also, um, yeah, solidarity. Yes. Welcome to to communist conlanging with, with uh, um, oh my comrade name. Miles and and comrade Jack. Is, is is this automatic gay space communism? Uh, this is this is gay alternative world communism. Ah. Calm you, wing. Oh gosh. Yes. We're the in Soviet Russia, language what creates you. you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Danielle. Thank you, Thank you Danielle. We did not we did not deserve this. So will you sure. something or another because uh, okay. Russia, you you do a vote for which out of Cha, Q, Sama, and Nether should be Horned Owl. Which shall be the word for Horned Owl? Actually, um, just make it 24, 25th, 26th, 27th, so you don't have to type out the accent. Thank you. And the taste, just so you know, um, I, because you are the experts upon the owls, I shall grant the a super delegatory little vote oh fully automatic luxury gay space communism that's exactly yeah. the phrase that i was trying to search for that my brain did not make out oh 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 okay oh ooh. I, I i'm wrecking the, the votes coming in Right now we're ooh. As we as we approach the end of our last stream, oh yeah. Two thoughts. We can either try and get through the list of words that I made, um, or we we decide that we can explain what these are better in a post, and maybe we just do the Happy New Year now. Um, do you, do you mean these words or do you mean, um, sorry, these, or do you mean this, or do you mean, um, those I'll, like, I'll copy and paste them. Okay. Cause the, the happy new year, I think that I'm trying to think by how much going to be based upon this. Yeah. I, I I was trying to understand what so, this really was. Yeah. Oh, the, this is what I sent you the the, the text about. No, the, yes, I know that, but like I I still I, I still don't understand what a weir is. I like. You don't have weirs in the U.S. It will. We probably do. I I I had never heard of this word until you had told me it. Okay, so a, a weir is like, so when you're trying to control the flow of a river, mm -hmm. you can build like a internal wall that limits whether the water, it's a bit like a dam. Yeah. Uh, but not quite. So this gets built, say, in, in the river and you can control the flow of it. So let's say like the salmon are in the river or the area of the weir and you can, w one, one could close it off and trap um, the fish in there. It's basically like, um, let me, I, I sent it to you as a photo, didn't I? So I can just pop the photo in. Yes. Um, actually, I, I don't know if people are going to be able to read it. Um, uh, also, 
I think spending our last 10 minutes reading a piece of academic literature is not, it, not what we want to be doing. I agree. Uh, Anywho, smoked salmon, you also had highlighted, but I also think that it is a good idea. Um, Ma uh, Magpie, I'm sorry. Um, I, I just saw your thing about the poll. I did just close it. Um, but I, perfect, thank you, taste. But, um, I will pronounce them, and if you want to disclose what you would have voted for, um, yes, and. So, the, the four words are chong, hu, sama, nada. Okay, are you sure? I felt bad, but that's okay, don't worry. But, um, well, we can do another one for these three. Oh, we can. So I okay, maybe like, we just take some of the basic ideas of these words, and we can turn them into words for the twenty ninth and thirtieth ourselves. Ooh, I I do so like. We do we have a word for smoke, for example? That was my first question. Um. And the answer is no. So let's assign one of these to smoke. Which I'm gonna make a poll for. I I do have a favorite for me this. Me too. Uh, can you send me a direct message so we can check if we both think the same thing? Okay, I'm sending it to you at this present moment. We do not have the same one. Okay. So the vote will decide. Which what does is ladu the... mean? What does what oh. mean? Ha ladu. <laughs> it's a uh, ha ladu. Ha ladu. Ha ladu. Highlighted. Oh, ha ladu. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, what are you saying? Is that, is that how people feel when I talk? Is that just like I say a word and they're like, what did you say? And they're like, I said this. And then they repeat it back to me and they have, I don't know what you said. So one thing we can't do is have the 26th Sama mean salmon. No. <laughs> well, I mean, th th thankfully, it, we do have a word for salmon. But if we were to make it Sokai... Ah, ah, yes, no, please. No, everybody, it, it, that's not going to option. So if, if we're making the salmon, it's going to be whatever... If, if, if Sama wins, then it, then that's going to be what um, Smoke is. If Sama don't win, then it ain't going to be salmon. Mm -hmm. But just to pronounce it for um home one more time, you know, Sama. Ariel, what do you mean the stream is going in a direction? The direction is towards success and towards season two and towards making Let's Have a Booba the, the best conlanging stream on the market. Well, first off, we already did that. We are already are the best stream. It is that our We're audience not on the market, on are we? We have not yet sold our souls to capitalism. That that is true. We we do not have a sponsored agreement yet, but or I, a Patreon or well, also that or a Patreon. But that 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 might could change also. So far, we're tied. So we need at least one more tiebreaker. Yeah. I mean, I've said this before. Let's have a river is conlanging after dark. <laughs> Like, like this is yeah. this is not your your family friendly comment stream. No, you, you, you would not put this right next to Miss Rachel and call them both morally right. It's just not going to happen. No, this is conlanging with Vietnam War jokes and horned owls. Hor no horny owls. Horny owls. <laughs> uh. 
We have apparently eight viewers, but I'm guessing two of them are us. Two of them are us, and two of them are just, I think. Is one of them Remy? One of them is can probably you Remy. Remy. He probably is here. Remy, if you can hear this, vote. <laughs> vote. Vote. Look, vote. Send, just send Don't my vote your brother, vote. however you can. Vote. Carrie Ann, oh, you're here. Did you vote? I'm begging you for your vote. What to get? I have on the TV. You. Yes, yes! We have a <laughs> End that poll. Yeah. So I would say my favorite uh, was Q. So of course we know who's who's the top of this. Um, uh, Rebby, as always. <laughs> So, some, sometimes I wish that we could have seen <laughs> both of us on this because I really do do some like fourth wall looking at like Jim Halpert esque doing stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, Q is smoke. Q so, number is Sokai Simon. Nda is Sokai Simon. And Sama, I, th I, think, I think it's going to be the weir. Well, I was thinking we should. Oh, I apologize. What if we was the nominalization of? Well, actually, it works as a product, doesn't it? But it could be like uh, to block or something, Ooh. which then could become a uh, um, zama. Yes, which would be um, a we. Or, uh, or, or I guess that would be like a dam. Okay, I'm gonna stop sharing because I have an idea. I don't want to spoil it to the people yet, mm -hmm. but I think, I think we have. I have a really good idea. Mm -hmm. um, let's see. We do this, and if we do this, right? You, you following me? Right, this could mean this. I'm sorry, Remy, if I am misrepresenting you. Um, but also, at this point, it's a running, a running Discord joke. So, so get yourself in. Oh, how do I share my screen again? Oh, I do this present now, and I <laughs> go to this thing, and I press share. So, how do we feel about this, people? So, just so you know, for those at home, hello, uh, that this word um, is the last four letters of the seventh planet in our um, solar system. I don't know why I'm censoring myself now, oh. but yes, Sama Ulu would mean block anus, and that would mean constipation. We also have this, which also. So it could be Samaka or Kasama. Oh, it's, yeah, yes. We could do oh, one man. final vote. You are one popular. Vote. One final vote, and then this is the last foray. What will the <laughs> compound for constipation be. We really are returning to our, our episode two roots by talking <laughs> about constipation. Block to block. I'll put, I'll, yes, block plus anus or um, to block plus bowels. Um, so it would be Sama Ulu. Uh, are, we, are we making this a compound or a like a collocation, um, the the second one. Okay. Do you know what? Why are you afraid of saying collocation? Collocation. I don't know what it means, but I think I know what it means. Okay, a collocation is just like a a pair of words that goes together more often than other ones, basically. 
like dire and straight. Yeah, in where where if you said dire, oh no, people say dire circumstances as well. They say but dire like, wolves. Yeah, uh, um, I'm trying to think. Um, it's for it, it's also the reason why you would say, like, do you have eggy soldiers in the U.S.? Do I have eight eggy soldiers? I, okay, it's it's when you have a hard boiled egg and you take the top off and you have little strips of toast that you dip in. I I've never heard of this. I, I, I don't tend to eat eggs too often, but <laughs> so okay okay it's like beans on toast. Ah, love beans on toast. No, so so beans on toast. If you said baked beans on toast, it sounds weird because the standard expression is just beans on toast. Yeah, that's the collocation. Oh, so yeah. I think I'm going to deem this poll done and ready because not only do I think it's we're pretty much good and done, but Tethys already comes out with the big guns. Um, plus bowels is constipation, and plus anus is to wear a butt plug. And I think I think. Oh. That yeah, we can't. I we can't. We can't beat that. Are um, we? Are we making that our thirtieth word? We can't put that on Instagram. Uh, right. Bubba, Bubba, you 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 poor you poor you poor person. What what have you walked into? I want to say. Uh, me. Anywho, <laughs> I. So. For sure, um, this I'm gonna do this. This is this. Oh, this is nope. This is this. This is that. This is to this. To this is to this. Is, is this is this really where where we're gonna end our, <laughs> our street? I mean, th this is the queerest thing that we could possibly have ended it by. Um, so everybody, um, this is this is the last boo before a while. Solidarity. We, we couldn't have asked for a better support and better um, um, yelching from um, our longtime friends and acquaintances. So what the hell is yelching? Was what? Yelching, yelching like 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 um what's it called like stealing from? <laughs> Lost. I don't know, but have a nice booba, everybody. Have a nice booba, booba, everyone. Everybody. Hopefully sooner than later. How do you hold? Oh, uh, we are changing the thirtieth. Stop, stop <laughs> streaming! Stop streaming! Stop it! Oh.